All right, well, I'm joined now by Jamie. Jamie, it was kind of windy yesterday. What are we going to see today? Well, it's not going to be quite as windy. It is still going to be breezy, though. So winds will be up a bit between 10 and 15 miles per hour this afternoon, and they've been up occasionally this morning. But again, we don't have those stronger gusts. It's 40 degrees, so it's a lot colder than yesterday morning when we were in the mid and upper 50s still at this time. At lunchtime, we'll be 47. Our high today only makes it to 50, but we'll enjoy a lot of sunshine right on through the afternoon hours. Drive home at 5 looks sunny. Temperatures cooling back into the upper 40s at that time. Right now, we're sitting at 40 degrees. We've got a west wind right around 8 miles per hour. Dew points are in the 30s, so likely we'll see our temperatures drop into the 30s over the next couple of hours before we start to climb. We've already seen that across the northern Miami Valley, a lot of 30s. 39 in Greenville and Troy, 36 up towards Bell Fountain, and 37 in Wapakoneta and Richmond. Still some low 40s across the southern counties, but dropping. Our upper flow, we are going to be in a trough over the next several days. So this is going to keep the cold conditions coming in. We get one blast of cold air over the weekend. We're going to get another push of cold air as we head into the first part of next week. So we're going to continue to see that trend where we're running below normal next several days. These are our high temperatures forecast. Uh, probably not getting out of the 40s. And even Saturday, not getting out of the 30s. The high Saturday, only 38 degrees. We'll come up again on Sunday. But then early next week with that next push of cold air, highs will be in the 30s again for a couple days. Here's a check of the satellite radar loop. We are pretty quiet across Ohio, back through Indiana, into Illinois. Just some scattered clouds at times today. But future track keeps us dry, even though we may see some high clouds around at noon. We're not expecting any rainfall. And at 5 o'clock, it looks nice and sunny for the drive home. Overnight, we'll stay mostly clear and quiet. And we'll head into Thursday with dry weather in the morning. We'll see plenty of sunshine through the first part of the day. A little bit of an increase in cloud cover, but partly sunny for the afternoon hours. And then tomorrow night, we'll start to see those rain chances go back up. Today, we're going to be mostly sunny. It'll be a breezy, cooler afternoon with a high near 50 degrees. Overnight, we'll drop to 30. It's going to be colder and clear. And then tomorrow, even cooler than today, only up to about 46, will become partly sunny for the afternoon. And then we'll see some rain chances Thursday night and into Friday. We may even see some snow mixing in across our northern counties Friday morning. And then again going into Friday night, some scattered light snow showers would be possible area-wide. But they'll be out of here by Saturday. In your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast, you can see that colder start to the weekend, 38 Saturday. And then next week, we'll start with highs near 40 and rain on Monday. And then some scattered snow showers and highs only in the mid-30s on Tuesday.